This is how I'm cleaning this bed boy. I made a concoction. This is my little cup here, cup shower combo. And of course, it's a concoction of vinegar and dishwashing. And you see how generous I am with applying all of it all the way to the top. I got a little water in here. Just add a little bit of water to that. And I have a cut right here. And I'm going to use, I just spray along, all along, all along. And so I go with this multi-purpose little brush. I got a little reach to it. I don't have the scrubber. I don't have time for all that. Perhaps we'll treat myself to a set for the holidays because I actually do do all the cleaning myself in the home. So I should have those tools I need so I don't burn myself out. But you see how, and you need to do this as often depending on how many people you have. It's, Especially the way things are out in the environment right now, right? So I just go back and forth. Do a nice little sweep back and forth. Do the bar, under the bar, you know. Just let it penetrate a little bit. But I do this quite often, several times out of the week. And so... It's not any cake one hard stuff. For those who haven't um, deep cleaned in a while, then you're gonna wanna let it penetrate a little bit. And that's pretty much how you do it. Sorry about the little pubic hairs. Well, actually, they're not pubic hairs, they're like the little hairs from washing. And over this too with it, right? All the way. Chance to get to the base of everything. Yeah. This thing is done just in a matter of minutes. It didn't take that long at all. And you gotta make sure you get the little nook and cranies and be good to go. Okay, and so let's rinse it off. I don't know what happened to my stopper. It doesn't work anymore. But I take a little cup, just like so, and let me show you how that looks. Pretty darn good. Get all the germs off. You know, takes a few. Like you don't want to splash it. Just take it to the wall. Keep a little bit in between. And then it glide down. And it should come clean. Bottom line. It doesn't take much to be clean. And my mama had us clean this. <laughs> we was like in an elementary so. This little stuff right here. I don't mind cleaning because this kind of stuff doesn't take much. If I don't know what to use, um, it won't cost me much to get a job done. And that's how to mind. So, let's do that. Let's see that's a little finished product. And of course, some parts you may feel like you might need to go over. By all means, go over it. If you have to, this is a quick little cleanup because, you know, I just don't feel like anything else at all. And again, some of us who have the scrubber tool, that's even better. It's going to shine even more. It's going to, it's, you know, like I said, I don't let my, I don't let stuff in my place. Let me come right here. But I don't let the things in my um in my surroundings get filthy or you know things like that. So this is how it looks. What do you think? It takes no time, right? Period. Keep it clean. It's too many germs out there. Don't play no games. 
And that's all it takes. See my reflection? 